girls. Welcome back inside the stash. Today, we are in the borough of Youngwood, Pennsylvania, which is a teeny weeny little town between Pittsburgh and Greensburg in southwestern Pennsylvania. For the, this is a mouthful, the old Potbelly Gang slash Salvage Crew Model Club Swap Beaten Contest. Uh, this will be our last local show of the year here in uh, southwestern Pennsylvania. Um, we are pretty much on hibernation until, uh, well, probably March. First weekend of March will be the Three Rivers uh, IPMS Club. That is my local IPMS club, of which I'm a member. And uh, that show ends up being two or three weeks earlier than it normally would be. We had a scheduling conflict with uh, another contest in the same region. If you're not familiar with the IPMS, they are split up into regions that cover certain states. And uh, Pittsburgh, Pennsylvania, the western side of the state is in uh, Region 4. And the Region 4 regional show ended up taking our weekend. So we're a few weeks early. At any rate... Not a lot of shows in, uh, you know, cold weather states in the wintertime, obviously, so uh, we are pretty much done. There are a couple more shows I could go to, but probably won't actually be able to attend, because in another few days, we'll be working six days a week at our job, uh, picking up the overtime as we're going to the holidays. So, all that being said, we are uh, at this last show, and uh, we're going to do this format the same as we did the show down in Virginia, so... This video will be of the vendor area, and then there will be another video coming uh, shortly thereafter of the actual contest area. This is a small show. Uh, it tends to be pretty well attended, uh, especially in the vendors. I haven't gone inside yet, so I'm just going basing on past years. Usually pretty well attended in vendors because this is our last show of the year, so it's the last time to sort of get out and uh, my car turns off. <laughs> It's the last time to get out and, and, and make big, you know, purchases, people clearing out their their personal stashes and stuff like that. We are fortunate here in Pittsburgh to have seven local hobby shops, depending on how far outside of the city of Pittsburgh you want to drive, in what direction you want to go. And so, you know, we're not short up on models year round, but this is sort of the last, uh, you know, social event of the year. And so, uh, yeah, we're going to hop on inside. Normally, uh, I would do these by showing you the building and stuff like that. But if you can't tell, looking at the background of my car, we're currently underwater today. Uh, big cold front coming through. It's been raining since about 3 o'clock this morning. And, uh, yeah, I'm not going to stand out in the rain and get wet <laughs> recording an intro. So, let's go inside where it's dry and we'll see what there is for sale. And, uh, yeah, check this out. Uh, this show happens the, the last weekend of October every year, so if you happen to be in the area, it might be something you want to remember to sort of jot that pencil in on your 2024 calendar. I have my trailer parked here, and again, Marty and my truck here. I didn't mean that. I measured David Taylor with a model registration Okay, so the box is going to be 29 bucks. 
We're going to go ahead and call that now to the winner. Like that was a static display. You can walk through. 
And then I got up the next morning and got back out and watched it take off. So, yeah, I got to walk through both of them. You've got to like uncle. I don't want to get rid of it. Because you know, if you have to go over there, you have to go fix something. You want to have a Right. Yeah, I love to swap. Oh, wow. yeah, another one is one of my sister's girls. It was summertime last year in August. I was out in the garage and I'm working. I had that. Yeah, I'll tell you what, I've seen some stuff in air shows.
it's a blue bag. It's delightful, forty-five or something. Yeah, they sell it at Walmart. They sell it. At, they don't sell it at all. They sell it at I think so. Excuse me. You know, where Sam's will get the two, throw them in the, in the freezer, and then the kids will eat regular. Sometimes we get it there, sometimes we just get it down at all, just the basic Italian bread, you know, and uh, take it from there. But, yeah. Well, I go to all of these. I go to Walmart, too. Mm -hmm. uh, okay. Okay.